All right, I've had people over in Netherlands and Germany and different places asking to do a review of some of the places here. One owner car guy, and this would be a unique one. Uh, we came to Fuddruckers, and it's in one of the malls here. And typical, really good American burgers. Butcher shop burgers. We're talking the good stuff. Now, as you can see, even though we're coming to eat here, my family's up from Australia, but we right here, the next car you're going to see up, or it might get up before this, is that red wagon there. We're getting it ready in the parking lot here, and I'm going to try to do it out back. Well, I'm going to try to do the car out back. So, Fuddruckers. Probably the best burger in America, I think, for like a chain brand. But, and you see it's rather cheap compared to Europe and Australia. with a third pound burger and fries. It's only $8.79 with a drink and everything. I'm going to order something in a minute, but I think the bun's fresh. And one thing you don't see in Europe, they got the fountains here where you get the drinks. And buddy, it's free refills. Anything you want, as much as you want. Not only that, you guys have to pay for ketchup and stuff. Well, we got the whole as much as you want. Hot cheddar cheese, jalapeno cheese, ketchup, mustard, mayonnaise, barbecue sauce, as much as you want for free. You got all these little things here. And you just do it to it. I'm going to show you this other side here. Really interesting. A lot of nostalgic 50s type lights and stuff around. But as far as other stuff goes, for your burger you get to add on any of these toppings that you would want. And you can take as much of it as you want. In fact, my ex-wife, she makes a salad when she comes here. Salsas, A1 steak sauce, Worcestershire sauce, vinegar, malt, you name it. It's all here. Let me get you the lettuce. If you can eat it, you can take a whole head of lettuce. And like I say, lots of drinks and, and it will make you a little bigger. Definitely a larger scale frame of people here than in the Netherlands. They got the Elvis stuff and all that on the walls. Games and all this stuff. I know they got this somewhere in the Netherlands. What's up, dude? Probably more expensive here, huh? Than the other place. Huh. Are we the first ones here? Craig's? Wow. I know Craig's here. Is his mom here? Uh, no, it should be here any second. Wow, I don't know what I did there. You hit some kind of jackpot. Yeah. You got all your balls out. Yeah. I figured we'd wipe it down here and I'll picture it out back. Oh, out back. I, I talked to the security guard already. Oh, yeah? And I said, can we picture a car here? Because there's a big pine tree up there. Yeah. It's real neat. Well, cool. I'm doing a review of Fuddruckers. There you go. Yeah. Say hi. Yeah. Hi. I'm at Fud Rockers. There you go. How do I get that? Oh, get gosh. It. That is not. Huh? It's not, is it? Huh. Yeah. Excuse me. I don't know if you've seen the malts. Oh man, that looks so good. This is one of the best places for bread. That goes in the back of the red Mercedes out there. All of it goes right out of the back of that red Benz. Hi. Hi. How are you? Good. 
Where's the dad at? Craig's, they're both playing video games at opposite ends. You've been gotten longer since I saw you. I just shaved last night. <laughs> Have you guys ordered yet? No. Oh, okay. Did you guys order? Yeah. Okay. We're not waiting for you. No, we didn't order yet. Oh. Look at the money. Okay, I'll tell Dad you're here. They're here. I didn't know if you knew that. They were looking for you. Your mom's here now. So, all these old signs are cool. A lot of food for a cheap price in comparison. I mean, this is a combo. You get the sandwich, the side salad, the drink for $8.69. There you go. Just to get a difference of the prices. You can get a one pound burger, which is almost a half a kilo, for $10.59. And you can get a buffalo burger, you can get a boar burger, you can even get an elk burger. They just started getting them lately. Uh, exotic burgers. The combos here, you get a big old thing of fries and a beer or a fountain drink. And a burger, $8.79 to $9.49. So we do pay a little less for uh, stuff here. And in California, and a lot of the bigger states, it's the law that the bigger chains have to have the calories on there. And they have to tell you how many calories are in their little thing, like on the combos. It's 894 to 1,074, usually depending on if you get cheese. If you're in the sides, there's your sides. They are rather cheap in comparison. Kids meals. You want to go smack her? Yes, I want you to. Take a review of the help, and she's rolling her eyes at us. <laughs> Would you look at that? Send it to the Fed Records Corporate. So, one more shot of the machines. You want coffee? Well, coffee is as much as you can drink free. And colas, as much as you can drink free. Has anybody the salad bar? I wanted to get a better picture of it. I can get all the double barbecue sauce bar again. And that is the whole deal, like I say. Everybody's a lot thinner there. I work hard not to eat all this. It's tempting to have all the food around and not to eat it. Very tempting. And I'll tell you, this end of it ain't gonna be too bad for you. Unfortunately, I do not eat vegetables. That looks good. Right you grind it up and blend it up for me, man. I'm all over it. One thing you guys don't get a lot of over there, we've got the coffee and the colas, and it's all free. As much as you can drink, whatever you like. Free refills. Free refills. And as much as you want. Teas, you name it. And they got two bays just in case one of them's. I'm gonna go order something. This is a uh, once over. Look at the signs and stuff. Awesome. Okay. Yeah, 11 people can eat here for about 75 bucks total. So, okay, well there's your fresh grill and nacho cheeses and all that. Thanks for watching. Uh, right now, even as we're out here doing reviews, we are, oh yeah, I don't think it's like this in Netherlands. That don't usually mean nothing. Well, to get you an outro here, this is the next car up. Just so you can see what's going on here. This will be the next one we do. And oh, buddy, am I telling you, it might even make it on here before this car. But, I mean, this video review of Fud Wreckers.
Nathan, 406-544-6919, oneownercarguy.com. Check out a lot of my reviews and stuff. Lots of young timer and pre-87 stuff. We import 86 and under there in the Netherlands and Germany. Thanks for watching. Have a great day or night, whatever it is, wherever you are, and hope this was something different for you. If you're in America, you've been to Fuddruckers. I mean, if you haven't, come get a burger and some free Wi-Fi.